sometimes the quick and easy projects are just what you need to make your day better. And this project is made possible by my grandma who found a picture online and she found like a thousand pictures. But this plant shelf thing, she found a picture of that online and she showed it to my girlfriend and me. And my girlfriend really liked this one and wanted us to make one for her sister as a Christmas present. So we got to work right away to make sure that we would be able to finish it in time for Christmas. I think in total it took about one and a half hour if you don't count the waiting time of the stain to dry of course and this was all done while filming so it could have probably been done much faster so no excuse for you to not go out and make this quick project yourself. This project is very straightforward. We just used some off cuts of wooden deck boards and trimmed them to length and split some of them in half. And I do say we a lot in this video, since I only did what my girlfriend commanded me to do, since she was the one in charge, apparently. And somehow, when I say this out loud, I suddenly feel like I'm losing control over my workshop. Maybe this is a plan to take over. Ah, that's future me's problem. Anyway. After splitting the boards in half, we lined it up and placed the shelf where we thought it would look good. And the way we want to mount the shelf is with a dado cut into the side pieces. So I cut some dados into the side pieces. It didn't need to be that precise as long as it's similar on both sides. And there is no plan to stick to since it's all made up on the go. Now when the dados are cut, I just need to put it back together so I can measure the top and bottom pieces. Well, let's see if it's square. Nope, absolutely not, but it will be in a second because I will clamp it up. These square clamps are great. A bit clumsy to work with sometimes, but at other times they are amazing for the job. What about square now? Perfect. I was a bit in doubt if the top and bottom pieces should be inside or outside the box, but then I remembered that I don't have to decide anything, I could just go ask and get the answers that way. So first I made a clean cut on one end. Then I measured the other. both to length at the same time with a board behind them to make like a zero clearance insert or zero clearance back insert would it be anyway it's for no tear out then i pre-drilled some holes in all four pieces to prevent the wood from splitting I screwed it into the end no gluing just screws to keep it simple
Now it just needed a way to be hung, and we decided that this thin piece of pine would be great for the job. In hindsight, we should have at least stained it two or even three times since it ended up being a slight bit brighter than the pre-stained deck boards. Anyway, some glue from a soon to be thrown out old and almost empty glue container. Then two brad nails off camera before handing it to my girlfriend who is in charge of sanding and staining since I was busy doing much busy important things and definitely not because I find it boring to sand. To be honest, she also needs to bring something to the table, right? This is how it all ended up looking, and she was the one who decided that the shelf should be in a darker color. And to be honest, I kinda like it like that. Makes it look more interesting. 